Hi there. So sometimes we get questions from customers who have a large number of assets and they have barcodes already printed and attached to their assets. They don't necessarily want to go through the process of replacing all of their existing barcodes with the QR codes that come from Limble. So I'm going to show you how you can upload the barcode numbers into Limble so that way when you use the mobile app to scan an existing barcode, it will still pull up the correct asset in Limble. So let me show you how we'll do that. First of all, I'm in the Assets screen here in my demo account. And what I'm going to do is, first of all, I'm going to add a barcode field to Limble, to my assets. And the way to do that is, first of all, I'm going to go over here to my Edit Visible Columns, and I'm going to add a column. I'm going to name it Barcode and I'm going to make it a text field. And the reason why I want to make it a text field is that it just makes sure that all the data imports cleanly without you know, possibly getting garbled if you have a bunch of number sequences. So the next stage is to go up to the bulk update button and what I'm going to do is I'm going to download my list of assets. Now I've already done that and I have the file open here. And you can see here that the last field that I have is barcode. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to add the barcode numbers I'm just going to copy them down. Now, usually you might have a list already existing. You can just copy and paste those into your, your spreadsheet here um, for the bulk update. I'm going to go ahead and save the file. And now I'm going to upload the file back into Limble. Okay, here we go. We have eight, eight, ats, pardon me, eight assets that will be updated. I'm going to go ahead and confirm. And there we go. You can see here that the barcodes have been added. So now when you use a mobile app to scan any existing barcode, the app will search for that number that's associated with the barcode and it will pull out the uh, appropriate asset. Let me know if you have any questions.